What important development stages has VPSA and PSA oxygen generation technology gone through? First, beginning stage, in the early 1970s, oxygen production by PSA technology was industrialized at for the first time. In the mid-1970s, the vacuum pressure adsorption oxygen production process was proposed, which greatly improved the scale and the economy of the oxygen plant, laying the foundation for the large-scale popularization and application of the VPSA oxygen production technology. Second, development stage, in 1989, VPSA oxygen equipment using lithium molecular sieve was put into operation, marking the entry into a new development period. China research began in the 1970s, but due to technical constraints, it was not until the 1990s that the first VPSA oxygen plant was industrially applied. Third, breakthrough stage, the College of Chemical and Molecular Engineering of Peking University successfully developed the high-efficiency lithium oxygen molecular sieve PU8 in 1996. In 2000, PKU Pioneer of Peking University succeeded in mass production of PU8, whose performance has reached the leading level in the international arena. In 2001, PKU Pioneer succeeded in the pilot test of the VPSA oxygen generating plant, adopting the high-efficiency lithium CPU8 and realized industrial application in the same year. At present, over 400 sets of VPSA oxygen generating units, with leading global performance of PKU Pioneer, have been built and put into operation providing cost-effective and efficient oxygen supply solutions for more than 20 fields such as iron and steel, non-ferrous metallurgy, glass and glass fiber, cement, sewage treatment, waste incineration, etc.